All right, so with about 30 minutes left before those rosters have to be at 53, y'all already know, like I told you, keep the notifications on because it's crazy right now. But anyway, so Ravens, they just released Chris Smith. I really thought he had a shot at making a roster. I really did. Um, but the Ravens must have felt otherwise. So Jalen Ferguson, hey, he's still there right now. So we'll see what happens with him. They also released kicker Jake Verity. Um, a lot of us, especially myself, I thought we were going to get a pick for him. And then after that Washington football team game, I thought we might get a conditional pick for him. Because wasn't nobody giving up anything serious for him after that game. Because that game was a big yikes. That dropped his value, dropped his stock way down. Um, so, and then, and we talked about it during the stream. Like, teams was probably like, oh, we ain't got to rush to trade for that kicker. We just let the Ravens cut him. Uh, but now he has been cut. Uh, and the Ravens didn't get anything for him. But now, Ben Mason. Ben Mason. Ravens, what, fifth round pick this year? So another fifth round pick. Oh, was it? Another, another rookie cut. Now, this rookie being cut is no shocker, though. Because this is something that I've been expecting to have. Well, I actually thought he was going to be IR. I thought he was going to be IR stashed. But... It looks like the Ravens are going to probably try to keep him around on the practice squad as long as he clears waivers. He got to get through waivers first. Now, in a league where they don't appreciate fullbacks nearly as much as the Ravens do, you got to feel like he'll make it. You got to feel like he'll make it. I, I think Ben Mason will be safe. But <laughs> you, you never know because it could always be somebody. And it could be some team just being a little petty too. Maybe like, you know what, we're going to claim Ben Mason. But at the same time, Teams got to worry about their own rosters right now. So they can't be fooling around uh, trying to do petty stuff to the Ravens because they still got to worry about their own. Um, so I, I expect Ben Mason to clear waivers and then for the Ravens to just put him on the practice squad. And I don't, I don't think anybody's going to take him off of their practice squad once he makes it there. I, I would not anticipate that for a fullback at all. But same thing, though. I, I still do believe that this is just this is the beginning. This is the beginning of Ben Mason and his transition to end up taking over for Pat Ricard. Again, like we've been saying, Pat Ricard is on the last year of his deal. I do not see the Ravens paying a fullback a third contract. Happened with Kyle Juszczyk. Remember, remember, remember him? We loved him, too. We loved him. But Ravens said, mm, goodbye. Pat Ricard. Love Pat Ricard. Ravens got a way of making us fall in love with these fullbacks, man. And Ravens, they, they keep that appreciation for the fullbacks because they run that ball so much. So with Pat Ricard, I expect him to do the same thing. It's going to be sad. It's going to be really sad. But that's the nature of the business because you got Lamar coming up. You got Andrews coming up. You got some more players coming up. So can you really justify paying a fullback, putting him on his third contract? You can find a way to do it, but you got to feel, feel like they'll take the, the, the cheaper route and uh have been mason end up taking over for pat ricard uh in the future so anyway um we have i'm recording this at uh 3 34 p.m so we have 26 minutes from the recording and it's going to take a little bit to upload now but we have 26 minutes from this recording till we get to the actual 53 man roster so there be no more speculation no more wondering we will have everybody who the ravens release cut ir kept all that good stuff, and you know we will uh, cover it all. Team Keep It Clean, I love you. Thank you all for, for following along with every single move that goes down because there's been a lot of moves that have been going down. Uh, but I appreciate y'all. I love you. And just like Ben Mason is for now, but he won't be for long, we out.